What's up? It's your boy Modern Ninja the Nerd back again with another video and today we got to talk about the greatest uncle in history, Sakuna. This is just a video of my opinion on the recent events of Jujutsu Kaisen, mainly Sakuna though. If you do not want to be spoiled, like this video and save it for later, you have been warned. Now play my intro real quick. So holy shit, I haven't uploaded any videos of anime content to catch up on these chapters in a while. Life got to me, and I'd say a few punches also. Anyway, what matters is I'm back, and this video should give you a good idea on what's about to happen in the future of this manga. Where we last left off, Higuruma had passed the torch over to Yuji to get rid of Sakuna. Yuji had been keeping up, to my surprise, and everyone else's. In recent chapters, Miguel, Shiesty Sorcerer, Maki, Yuta, and even Kusakabe had shining moments with our man Sukuna, and he's given everyone praise except Yuji. Apparently, Yuji's dad is the reincarnation of Sukuna's twin brother, whom he's eaten in the womb. It isn't explained much, but this uncle versus nephew fight isn't your average barbecue brawl. We see Yuji go toe to toe with Sukuna, even him learning reverse curse technique and using Sukuna's shrine and using the simple domain. Yuji is beating the side character allegations and showing us how he is the main character we all knew him to be. Unfortunately, I have a sneaking suspicion Sukuna is still holding back a great deal. In the most recent chapter, Uncle Sukuna, after dropping Choso's reboot card, Big Brother of the Year, by the way. Yuji and Toto was getting it back in blood. Toto popped up with a bop it on his hand and literally was speed blitzing the guy when Yuji had Sukuna's heart in his hands about to finish it, or so he thought. When Sukuna saw the ghost of the strongest, Satoru Gojo, it was lit. It didn't make sense to me right then because Yuji and Toto looked like they had it, but my white haired king was back and that's all I really cared about. I used to pray for days like this. When I saw a goddamn scar on his forehead, my balls dropped to my ass. I was like, ain't no way this man from the ghetto got into Gojo's body. I thought it was said that he couldn't because the six eyes repelled him. But Sakuna apologized to Yuta. He didn't know Yuta rode like that for real. And once again, my balls dropped. At this point, my voice was deeper than the Allstate man that your grandma swears is cute. Yuta Okotsu distant cousin of Gojo, now piloting bro like a Gundam. I gotta say, Gege be cooking but in ways I've never thought possible. A gripping story, but damn. Yuta was gripping his pearls the whole fight because he knew if Gojo lost and died, he'd be that much closer to having to jump his ass into the Gojo body sleeve. Nasty stuff. It also doesn't help that Yuji doesn't know a damn thing about any of this. All Yuji knows is he had Sakuna's heart and Sakuna threw him like he didn't have a vital organ of his in his palm. Feeling Sakuna get excited seeing his boyfriend come back from the dead just so they can rub domains together. I know he would be against this idea. He's lost so much and to turn and see Gojo but finding out it isn't really him. Either bro will stop moving again, racked with depression, or he might do what needs to be done with a look of straight horror. A lot of people think that he'll attack Yuta but I don't see him doing that. I feel he'll understand to some degree and realize whoever is in Gojo is trying to help stop the merger. But what do you guys think? Was this the biggest plot twist in the series so far? Or was this something that you guys all expected? Let me know in the comments down below and recommend anime or manga for me to read so I can dive in and get back into the swing of things. We're still below a thousand subscribers of you awesome people, but we can grow our family with a simple click of a button. Subscribe and hit that bell so you can feel my energy every time I upload. I love you all. This has been your boy, Modern Ninja the Nerd. See you in the next arc.